So if you have a microbit that was not purchased from Feria Labs, you'll have to do a maintenance update before you can use it with CodeSpace. So the first thing you need to do is hold down the reset button while inserting the USB cable. Of course, the other end needs to be plugged into your PC while you do this. And then release it. And when you do that, you'll see a maintenance drive uh, appear on Windows. If it doesn't pop up, you can go look at your file manager and see it. Then go to the help menu, click firmware download, and select the maintenance link, which will download a maintenance hex file to Chrome. Drag that hex file over to the maintenance microbit drive. In this case, it's drive E on my computer, but it may show up as something different on yours. Once that's been copied over, you'll see the dialog disappear and then reappear as micro bit rather than maintenance. Now click the MicroPython link, which will download the MicroPython hex file. And take that hex file, click and drag it over to the micro bit drive. And this is updating the MicroPython part of your micro bit. So that'll take a few seconds to download. And once it does, you will be ready to uh, go back to CodeSpace, close the dialog there, and now you can click on the USB icon at the top of the screen where the web USB dialog will allow you to select the micro bit, connect, and you're ready to start coding. Welcome to CodeSpace.